Hey yo, what it do, y'all? It's your boy J to the M to the K. So saucy, man. We here with some more 2K shit, man. We got a badge. We got we got the best badges in the game. You feel me? Best shooting badges specifically. And look, I ain't got my badges yet, but man, I'm here. I'm I'm gonna here to go through every single badge in here and tell you what you should put on and what you shouldn't put on. Alright, so yeah, let's get in this bitch. Look, man. Off rip, bro. Catch and shoot. You know, this is a good badge. I give it, you know what I'm saying? It's a really good badge for all the, for all the off-ball shooters. It's a good badge. Even for a person that has on-ball, you know, you ain't always got the ball. You can't always have the ball at all times. And sometimes you're that man that's wide open. Just spot up, you know? You were spotting up, or spot up shooting, catch and shoot. You know what I'm saying? It's a good badge. Recommend it. Highly recommend it. Especially if you got a lot of badges. Oh, this is a must-have. Clutch shooter, man. Be real. Be real. This badge right here, my career. But you can use it in park. I heard it's alright. So, I mean, you know, go ahead. If you got enough badges, you waste on it. or Go ahead and try that, I guess. I ain't, I ain't one to judge, you know. I ain't one to judge. I won't use it personally, though. Corner specialist, corner spec, bro. Corner spec, corner specialist, corner spec, man. This badge right here. This it's, it's the OG badge for years. No lie, it's always good. It ain't never gonna be trash. Hell, it's better than it's better than what it's been in past years. Cause guess what? It works in the mid range too. It could be all. It just gotta be near the corner. So yeah. So at the very edge of the wing, it works at the. Bro, it works regardless, bro. Corner specialist is a good badge. The mid range corner and to the to the, all the way to the three point. It works so good. I recommend you get that badge. Dead eye. Dead eye. See this badge right here is good as hell too. Look man, I'm just getting so many good badges. Be real. It's a good badge. Now, granted, it's not the um you want to take open shots regardless though, but you know, sometimes you get closed out heavy and this, you, hey, you might get that green bean, you feel me? Get that green light. So, hey, you do what you gotta do. I wreck, yeah. Yeah, you do what you gotta do. But it's not one of the more important badges though. I, I'm like, you know, deep fade. Here we go. Next one. Deep phase, deep phase, deep phase. This is a post guard badge. I mean, if you a guard, you shouldn't be having this on unless you want to be taking. Post phase and shit. I don't know. See, it's it's a weird badge. All right, I don't recommend it if you are a guard. But I mean, let her float your boat. If you if you think you a post fade man, you like to take post fades. Hey man, this your this your badge. Difficult shots. This badge is OP, man. I'm telling you, especially right now in this game, bro. Fadeaways are OP. Like you you don't even gotta agree them. You can like in the game. Like on some 10 for 10 type ish, all whites. And if you had this badge on, it's OP, bro. Max it out if need be. I ain't trying to promote cheese because I, I hate that niggas hitting whites right now, but it, mean, it is what it is. Man, so yeah, I recommend that one. Flexible. Flexible release. Uh, this year, I don't think it's that bad, to be honest, because, I mean, to be real. People can't shoot, I guess. Motherfuckers suck ass. So, I mean, go ahead. If you, if you got enough badge points to waste on it, but I don't rec Like I said, if you're trying to shoot, though, I don't think you should just put this on. Nah. Wasting your time. I feel like you should put this on. Like, it's like If you got hella badges to waste, like if you got like 30, 20 something shooting badges plus 20, you know, yeah, go ahead. Not, why not? It won't hurt. It really wouldn't hurt. Green machine. Green machine, man. Top tier badge. You get a green. It's a streaking badge. It's a, it's a green light streaking badge. Y'all shit go. Your percentage to get a green go up, 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 up in the way. You probably like, well, I ain't got it, man. Me personally, I use it on like bronze, but it works regardless. Like, don't don't get it fucked up. I you know I have. If you got enough badges, man, get this bitch Hall of Fame. Why the fuck not? If you don't, I say like gold, silverish. Or yeah, bronze if you if you like that bronze, hot start man. This a it's a good badge. You now you better be able to hit your shots, bro. Cause 
once you get started, it's another streak in veg. Cause once you get started, if you fuck up any time, it's over. You legit. This is this this is a per this is a what you call it a perfect a perfection badge. If you ain't doing perfect when it comes to shooting, do not put this on. You wasting your time. Shit like that. Hot zone hunter. Bro. I ain't said bro so many times this video, but bro, it's, it's it's real talk like this a really good badge. Right, man, you can go from shooting dog shit and talking about breaking everything, but you better have hot zones. If you ain't got hot zones, this badge is absolutely useless. It is only good if you have hot zones. Remember that. But if you got hot zones, bro, you will go from shooting like dog shit, whites and everything, to straight greens. I'm like, I'm not even playing. Hell, you'll hit hello whites, you'll hit even more whites in them hot zone areas too. Bro, it's... it's you good? Ice and veins trash. It's free. It's a free throw badge. You don't don't ever put this on. You wasting. You shouldn't. You shouldn't even need this badge for anything. Just don't, don't even waste your time. Pick and popper. Uh, center. I guess a center can use this center. Yeah, it's alright. Badge stretch big. I mean, it ain't. I don't know if you. That's just. Eh. I ain't have much experience with it myself, but I don't think you need it like that. To be honest, it's. But you, you can try it. I mean, if you got the badges to try it, but go ahead, bro. I'm telling you, if you got hella shooting badges, try them out. I mean, why not? Pump fake maestro. Who pump fakes? Be real. Who the fuck is pump faking? Who the fuck is pump faking? On to the next shit, bro. Range extender. Need it. Must have. Absolutely. Bro, I don't care what your 30 point rating is, bro. Range extender will make you a demigod. You know why? It will extend your range now. It, it just make and also don't get it fucked up. Like it, it increases your three point percentage from where you was shooting. Like if you was shooting real close, like in the mid range, it increases your three point percentage. Cause guess what? You have a range extender works for the mid range and for the three. So if you're shooting deep ass mid ranges and you you feel like you can barely green it, range extender will improve that shooting experience. Vice versa for the three point shooting too. So range extender is highly recommended. I recommend it to a T. One of your first badges. Slippery off ball? No. I mean, eh, if you, if you know how to use them animations, some little weird stick animations they added, why not? But no, I don't recommend it. Steady shooter. Alright, so if you shoot trash ass shots, like if you shooting dumb ass shots, I mean, why not? It's, this is your type of badge, man. That's my type of badge. Real talk. Real talk. But, I mean, it. <sighs> Go ahead, man. If you got the badges to use it, I don't recommend it. If you ain't got much shooting in the first place, I do. I definitely don't recommend these badges. I this badge right here. I don't recommend it at all. Steady shooter is awful for people who's trying to shoot good, cause it, it, you lose open shot bonuses and gain contested shot bonuses, which is lower for you, cause you got a trash three. Do not put this on if you can't shoot. If you can shoot, I mean, why not? It won't hurt like that. It's going to hurt a little bit because you can read it. Reduces penalties for contested shots and bonuses for open shots. Like, just straight like that. And tireless shooter, man. I mean, you know, make shots when you fatigue. I mean, if you got badges to use it, why not? I'm telling you. If you got the badge, I don't recommend it if you, like, if you shooting like that. You know, I mean, like, if you... Shooting, if you ain't got any shooting badges, I don't recommend this badge. You're wasting your points on it because you can't shoot in the first place. So, why the fuck you gonna try to shoot when you're tired? Be real. And volume shooter, um, this is like a wreck badge. If you go to wreck a lot or pro am or some shit, like I'm talking about not 3v3, but like 5v5 game modes, this is the badge. You, whether you missing or hitting your shots, your three point percentage will go up. I recommend you hit them things though, because you know. It's gonna balance itself out if you fucking breaking hella shots and you making hella shots, but you know it's gonna even itself out. So I mean, yeah, you do what you do. And that's all I really got for these shooting badges, bro. So me personally, what I'm running is hot zone hunter, range extender, difficult shots, and green machine. You know, and if I feel like I want to change something, I feel like I don't need something as much. I'll take some off a range extender, put it on data. Or I'll take it off of data, put it on catch and shoot. And 
Maybe I just max out Green Machine one day. I don't know. Volume Shooter. No, mm -mm. not putting none of them badges on. They're not for me. Corner Specialist is a good badge. Shit. But I'm telling you. I'm, I'm going to name the badges that you should have the most. Like the must have badges. Here they go. Catch and Shoot. Green Machine. Hot Zone Hunter. Dead Eye. Volume Shooter. I say Range Extender. Yeah, Range Extender. Difficult Shots. And that's really it. No, those are the must have. Those are the must have. I mean, if you're a big man like a post score, deep fades, dead eye, um, the uh, range extender, I guess. Fuck on hot zone hunter. Fuck difficult shots. Yeah, but or not when I say big man, I mean like a post score. I meant to say post. If you are a post score, put them on. If you like a big man, like well, like a seventy something catch and shoot. Corner specialist, high zone hunter, range extender, and um, volume shooter, and green machine. Like, those are the badges you trying to aim for. I don't rec take away volume shooter. Like if you ain't got the badges to get volume shooter, that's it. That should be your last badge. Green machine, range extender, catch and shoot, and corner specialist should be your first badges. I don't give a fuck. And you can add dead eye too if you got enough badges for it, but. Yeah, that's really all I got to say for y'all boys. Uh, leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications. I'll catch y'all boys later. Um, peace.